Our point was that white and black Southern culture related and and crossed each other. And we were coming out of the civil rights movement and that we could put white musicians and black musicians on stages in the South. It was really, really scary getting to the hall because you had to travel through towns and we had to deal with that sometimes. But we could get them on the stage and there was a statement we could make about the culture and the sharing in the culture that might be helpful uh, as the South tried to contend with uh, where we were going with the civil rights movement issues. Um, I, I didn't know how to fight all my life. Um, I had to teach myself. Uh, the biggest, biggest thing I had to overcome was this uh, voice inside that said, if you do this, you'll kill yourself. You'll get killed. It was just so loud. And stepping across that inner voice was really uh, traumatic for me. I discovered if you don't cross that line, you never meet yourself. You never become who you can be unless you can get past your socialization uh, where, where you, that older generation has told you what they have learned about survival. You actually have to break ranks with it or you will never meet yourself. It is like stepping outside of a safety zone. It is very hard to do. But if you ever do it, you always know how to risk your life. In our culture, anything you do disappears the minute you stop doing it. And freedom is like that. People think you are born into freedom. The only freedom you have is the freedom you're exercising. And sitting down thinking it's going to be there when you need it, it is going to give you a big surprise.